Hey guys, welcome back to another new video. It's Eric Reacts, back at it again. You're right, Arthur Sims. It's only a mystery. Taking it back, my friends, to 1985, the year I was born. You know that year, what a magical year that was. And we'll be taking a look at the official video clip. This is a Patreon request, and I can't wait to get my hands on this. Let's see what they've got for us. Before we get into the video, please take a moment, comment, like, and subscribe. Makes videos like these all the more possible. And also, take a moment to follow me and like me, both on Instagram and on Facebook. If you're new to the channel, guys, welcome. I also have a Patreon link down below. Be sure to check that out when you get a chance. Help support my channel. Makes recommendations like these all the more possible. Guys, if I go bananas, you know the drill's going to go directly to my Spotify. Be sure to follow me there. Derek Reacts, link in the description down below. I also have great merchandise for you all. Check it out when you get a chance. Derek Reacts.store. Custom tees like this one. Feel the groove and many others. A lot of goodies there, guys. Check it out when you get a chance. If you like the video, be sure to smash the subscribe button, like the video, and also hit the notification bell to stay on top of all my latest reaction videos. Stay till the end as I give my post analysis reaction. You don't want to miss that. All right, guys, without further ado, let's go. Wow. How can I keep on smiling? Disguise when I know nothing good ever comes from lies. I like this. My heart is no beginner. Sounds like percussions, but still, I can lose my temper. Oh. His voice is good, guys. How can we keep on watching that fucking TV? Oh. <laughs> did he just curse? Yeah, he did. We're so bored. We don't even care what we see. Takes our strength away. And never. Never shows us the way. No. Oh. But I think I know the answer. It's only mystery, and I like it. It's only mystery, and I like it. I was waiting for the drums to come in. I like it. It's only mystery. How can the banks of a river me? Uh. Sitting on her bed, staring at her feet. So, guys, this is an interesting type of song um, because it's very. It has it had the slim the, the the tempo to this is very slow. You think it's you think it's gonna pick up, but it doesn't really. It doesn't really. When the chorus comes in and the drums break in, that's good. Creates separation, so are you getting it? His voice is a standout. Love the the way the percussions are used in this song. Um, but I think I think his voice is what's taking this. Seems like this is a ba uh, based off of a, a movie. We're getting like a clip here with like very cinematic. I think this is a movie. Um, I have to look at my my information. What what movie this was for? Because it's that's what it seems like. But some keyboard work, nice guitars that come in strummed, right? Nice strummed guitar. But the the percussions and his voice stand out. Stand out, guys. She thinks life is water. And love, love is a river. Oh. It's only mystery and I like it. Oh, it's for Prado. It's only mystery and I like it. It's only mystery. We could dream of a grand evolution. Sounds like a bridge. Sounds like a bridge.
up. So the strings come back to me. I like it. It's only mystery. And I like it. Oh. You want to keep singing? I want to keep singing. Oh, so this guy. He looks familiar. I've seen him in movies before. I think I've seen him like in other sci fi films. Um, it's very interesting. Uh, this is an interesting video. <laughs> I wonder what movie this is. I have to take a look at this. It's only a mystery. Um, Arthur Sims, guys. Arthur Sims. Um, I'll look at my information in a minute. Before I, I wanna, wanna, before I get into that, I want to discuss something. So the thing is, this is a good song. The structure's okay. Structure's okay. I like the strings, creating some separation with the, um, with the percussions, right? Um, but there, it really doesn't take off. It doesn't really take off. It's kind of like in that same fashion. And the thing that you look forward to is the chorus part where he, he's singing, it's only mystery and I like it. It's very singable. You want to, you want to sing to it. You, you kind of like want to, want to kind of sing in his place. If you don't understand what I mean, you catch what I, what I mean when I say that. And that's good. That's a good thing. That's a good thing. That's, that's a good thing with a song. When you catch yourself singing, singing to it, that means you enjoy it. But it just doesn't have that oomph. It doesn't have, it doesn't have that uh, that push to put me over the edge. You know, it just needed something else to put me put me put me over the edge, and it just didn't have it. Happens for for me. So that's why I didn't throw my approval. But written and composed by uh, Corinne, um, Luis, and uh, and Eric Sierra, performed uh, by by singer Arthur Sims, and it was created for the soundtrack film of Subway by Luke Besson. That's the movie Subway. Never seen it. Never seen it. But I've seen that guy before in other movies. So there's that. But the bassist is from Telethon, the group, French group. Corinne uh, Marnou was also in a relationship with the bassist uh, of Jacques Hinglin and Eric Sera. So the latter then just signed the music for the film The Last Fight by Luke Besson. In 1983, so a lot of folks here that know each other. Uh, the director was preparing to make his second feature film, Subway, and asked Eric Sierra to write two songs with uh, with an American, but the latter, whose identity has not been revealed, refuses. And Corinne is urgently called to replace her while she finishes the recording of the album Un Otro Mund by T Telefon. And actually, I actually reacted to that. That was actually pretty good. In one night, she writes the lyrics. It's only a mystery. Guns and people gives them. Uh, gives them to Sierra, who records to the music. But the version of It's Only Mysteries is refused by the director. And um, Maranu asks uh, that one of his friends in the group, Luis, uh, to make a new model, which is then validated by Luc Besson. After that, the two songs were recorded um, in Paris, in the studio in Paris. And it was given to Arthur Sims to sing. And there was that. So that's how it came, came about. That's how it came about. So great instrumentation with uh, keyboard arrangements, bass. The bass was nice. Guitar strings. Love the strumming of the guitar strings. Um, the percussions were great. Apparently there was some saxophone, trombone. I didn't hear them. I didn't hear the brass instruments. Did you guys hear the brass instruments? I was so focused with his voice, you know, uh, that I may may have you know missed them. But lyrics are very simplistic. I'm not going to go over them. The only thing that kind of stood out was that he kept watching TV and he <laughs> watching that fucking TV. Did you hear that? <laughs> So he threw some curse words in there. Very interesting, guys. Um, interesting recommendation. Interesting recommendation. Please let me know what you think about this one down below. We'll love to hear what you have to say. Until next time, for more videos like these, guys, take care. Hey, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you'd like to see more videos like these, be sure to check this one out. And also, take a moment to comment, like, and smash the subscribe button to stay on all of the latest reaction videos. And, guys, yes, I have a Patreon link. Be sure to check that out when you get a chance. Help support my channel. Makes recommendations like the one you just saw all the more possible. All right, guys. Take care. Love you, guys. Peace.